Okay, uh, we're down at Timeless R3 Finishing in Grand Rapids, Michigan. 616-453-8309. We're showing these uh, dresser drawers. They go to a Kendall High Boy dresser. We're doing these in a tortoise finish. Some of these over here you can see have not had anything done to them yet, but uh, the decoration work as far as... Uh, the finishing work. Now this particular one right, right here has a pin dot pattern put on it and a little animal in Jetso. This one here same thing a little animal in Jetso pin dot pattern. I'm going to pan it over here. There's the starts of a dragon right there. We go over here there's a little house. You can still see the pin dot pattern as we're panning down here. <laughs> You can see has Sandy Cuspit had started to uh, decorate on this already. He's got some little people in a village and some mountains. It's looking very nice already. And uh, she's just getting started. This last one here, you can see it has the hardware on there. She puts the hardware on there so she knows that she does not have to decorate under that. Um, <laughs> Here's a little wagon with some birds, some little flowers, there's another dragon right there, and a little beautiful little woman right here. Now she's not done with any of this here, she still has uh, faces and to put on and lining and shading. some shading. What else, Sandy? Shading and lining, detail work like tall grasses and weeds and things like that. So this is just kind of roughed in but it sure is looking awfully nice and uh, we have to apologize if the picture is a little blurry because we're doing this on a smartphone and I am actually uh, wiggling around showing you here. So uh, <coughs> Sandy's going to demonstrate a little over here <coughs> on this dresser. Uh, here's another one of the drawers. Gotta hope we can see this okay because there's a lot of glare going on in here. Um, but you can see here she's got some flowers over here and some little mountains going on here, a little village. Once again this is just kind of a jewel in the rough here. It takes a while to uh, make something like this look absolutely gorgeous. And Sandy does a very good job of that. She's I'll been... do a little bit of a fady mountain in the background. So yeah, that's... you're going to work over here. Let me, uh... yeah, there you go. Oh, it's perfect. That little stick she has there is a, what is it, Sandy? It's called a mall stick. It steadies your hand and it keeps your hand out of your work. And uh, that's the way I was taught way back you know when I first started decorating furniture for disciplined work you have to use a mall stick and you make it look so easy I like that too I like the way that mountain is it's gonna be a short little video here <clears throat> she's going over here a little lacquer. I'm, what I'm doing is I'm side loading this brush with lacquer and gold powder, and uh, it, it's just a side load, and that way, that's the technique. I think it looks nice. How do you make it look so easy? Hmm. Thank you. Kind of like when you watch a Bob Ross video and he's making it look so simple until you give it a try. I know this is going to be blurry with me moving back and forth. Hmm, I'm sorry. So that's kind of like a mountain and then later I can come back and I can highlight it a little mm. if I choose to. But I don't want to go too much further on that right now. All right. And is there anything else you can show us I here? Can, I can show you the same technique for groundwork. Yeah, I'd like to see that. 
you notice I put my brush in the lacquer and then just the corner of it into the powder. Oh. And that's a side load. Sometimes you can side load multiple mm -hmm. uh, different colors. Of so we're right over here. This will be the groundwork under this little, I don't know what it is, little, little outdoor building. That looks really good, Sandy. Thank you. It's just amazing what you've done there just in a minute. Hmm, thank you. And yeah, it looks like she can get a lot done, but she'll be working on a on a, this case here for probably a good maybe 40 to 60 hours. All right, that looks pretty good. Okay. Thank you, Sandy. You're welcome, Bruce. <laughs>